Mordechai Tzadik and Esther Amalka enforced that on Purim you should give Meshloyich Monas Ishlari Eyu. You should give food for others. What does that have to do with Purim? Isn't Purim meant to recognize Hashem's hand in every day? To realize that Hashem is the one who runs the world and does all the Nisim? What does Meshloyich Monas have to do with Purim? There's another thing what really bothered me. Nothing to do with Purim. It was actually Chodesh El. Where Chodesh El, I walk into a yeshiva, and there's a big poster there. Please be more kind to your friend. Be nice to each other, because Rosh Hashanah is on the way. What does that have to do with Rosh Hashanah? What does being friendly to each other have to do with Rosh Hashanah? Isn't Rosh Hashanah meant to King Hashem and say that He is our King? And then I was thinking to myself that yes, the only way how a king can be king is only if he has people. A king without people is not a king. So that's why that poster makes sense. Be unity. Be friendly to each other. And that's how all of us together will be able to king Hashem to be our king. And say yes, he's the one who runs the world. So to Purim, Purim is meant to recognize Hashem's hand in the daily basis. See all the Nisim Hashem does in every day. And the only way how to do that is to be friendly with each other, give food for each other, and that's the only way how to show that yes, we are together, and we believe and know and see Hashem's hand in every day.